Hello, in this video we're going to show you how to use the 3D particle object in your 3D scene. Basically a particle allows you to simulate loads of different small objects, basically they're usually sprouts images, uh, into some sort of cloud, part, I mean into fire, ash, smoke, that sort of stuff, sparks. And 3D particle is no different, it's just in 3D. So we can just drag on a 3D particle like so. By default, it has a particle image. And the format is PU, which is particle universe. And you can change the image right, I mean the particle file right here. It's gonna actually import a some particles. You can do it by right click import or by file import resources on my desktop I've got a scripts folder just a bunch of particle scripts these were basically with the Cocos 2DX folder so I'm just using them so if I were to drag on let's see what we've got ribbon trial test see what that looks like so this is what it looks like it looks pretty cool it's not always what you think of when you think of particles to do with games but they are particles yeah let's do a can of worms this is a funny one there you go. What you can also do is drag it up and drop it so like so and what it does is creates a particle but we're just happy with just the one we dragged on. So we let's just change it to flame system. One second do, 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 do. there it is flame system. You might think they don't look the best and that's nothing to recall studio that's just the original file and how it was created or in terms of what its properties were so if you create a better particle and you import it it will look how it should do and this is like a black hole zoom out quite a bit Okay, UV animation, and yeah, that's how you use a particle in the application. They're really useful to just create a sense of realism in your world on 2D scenes and 3D scenes. If you have any questions, literally any questions at all, feel free to post them on sonarlearning.co.uk forward slash question dot php don't worry you don't need to remember that there will be a link in the description and as usual thank you for watching and i hope you have a great day